If I had magic and baton. If I happened to be the magician. If I had a magic spell. If I had a magic power to change one thing in Bhutan. If I could change one thing in Bhutan, I, it would be the preconception of the youth that they cannot do anything. They are really capable of and they can change how the world functions. I want to change the people's view on mental health. One thing I would like to change about Bhutan is the economy of the country. Make it less reliant on the neighboring countries. I want all the people in Bhutan to know that what they do consciously or unconsciously affects the environment. I would really like to inculcate the sustainable behaviors uh, in the Buddhist people. I will reduce the waste. Completely ban plastic consumption in the country. Clean all the garbages, dirty garbages. If I have power, I can improve the country by uh, bringing the new, new technologies. I will bring <laughs> adaptation of new technologies. I'll make sure that all the youths are out of drugs. I also like to create uh, employment opportunities in my village, you know. Like in Bhutan, recently like uh, there are many youths like uh, being unemployed. The youths in Bhutan today, they are not willing to go back to the village and uh, work in the field. I would influence all the youths to have the mind to go back to the village and uh, take care of their lands. I would uh, focus in forging food citizenship amongst uh, Bhutanese. If I have that superpower, I would like to help the old people the most. Everybody wish for some sort of magic, but I personally feel that I am the magic. I don't think we really need supernatural power to change ourselves. If we can change the mindset of the youth, I think we can really bring the changes and development in the society. It is our roles and responsibilities to change our country. We have to be a leader and we should know how to advocate others. I like to volunteer to work in the drug and uh, substance abuse areas where many of the youth are involved. I would love to go back to my communities where I see that there are a lot of women or girls of my age who are uneducated. They are holding the babies and staying at home. Their husband dominating them because they are small, they are not educated, they cannot raise their voice, they cannot do what they want to do. I want to educate those girls and make them understand the importance of education and what women can do. I love volunteering as a health worker and serve my people with compassion and passion. I am interested in volunteering and in helping others, but I don't know how, so that's the main reason why I came in this youth summit. After coming to this Youth Summit, I came to learn that I can do many things that can bring changes in our society. What I learned was how I can initiate change. While being here, uh, I've listened to many stories uh, where the youth, they have uh, raised their voices and they have contributed in the community. I was really like a shy person and I was not open to everyone, but I gained confidence. The most interesting thing that I have learned is that we can change our interest into benefits for others. The one thing that I've learned from this summit, the greatest one thing is being adaptable, the ability to listen to others, the ability to talk in the crowd. I've learned that you can be a change maker and I guess it's true. Whatever knowledge I got from here, I'm not going to keep it only for myself. I'm going to share with all my friends. Like I have changed, I want to make change in them too. Wherever I be, I will observe the uh, problems, circumstances and the conflicts that the people face normally there. <laughs> One day our country will be full of great leaders. With the young capabilities and with the young blood, we can do many great jobs. There is no need of waiting for any such uh, financial support or uh, budget or something. Now I want to experience my LGBT to be the pillar of change. We are all in this together. Working in collaboration with each other, sharing knowledge, ideas. You can have a very big dream, but in order to fulfill that dream. Think big, but act small. We the youth are the future leaders. Whole country depends on us. So to the community, we hope to give you a solution. Everyone can come together and work together. We are never too young to make a change. We can make a difference. Because we are the change makers. No? We are the change makers. Youth is a change. The world will look beautiful.